And welcome back to Let's Play Story of Seasons, Friends of Mineral Town. Where am I going? I need to go pick up my golden hoe. Alright, so I don't think there's anything else I really need to upgrade at the moment. I'm considering upgrading the axe, but at the same time, hmm. You know what, that would be a terrible idea, but... At the same time, it might be better just to wait until it's golden. Just so that we'll have a level 4 axe start cutting down like big stumps with. Yeah, you know what, we don't need to upgrade it yet. I do have the money for it now, thanks to the pineapples coming in, but I kind of also want to keep it just so I can keep gathering wood. Because I want to start getting some building upgrades soon. And yeah, I think my next biggest priority would be to upgrade the chicken coop. Unfortunately, we're still very short on both lumber and ore. Or not ore. Uh, lumber and stone. Although at this point, you know what? I'm debating if I want to just straight up buy the lumber. Eh, no, that's still a lot of lumber. I'm pretty sure I can actually afford it right now, though, if I just decide to buy the lumber and stone instead of having to grind it out. We'll see. Anyways. So we'll keep gathering wood and lumber. That's the same thing. We'll keep gathering lumber and stone. And then in a few days, uh, we're going to see some fireworks. Pretty sure we can still ask Cliff to come with us, even though, you know, technically we haven't fully unlocked his whole relationship thing yet, just because we have to wait until fall to do that. But I'm pretty sure we can still ask him out to the fireworks fest. I mean, we'll find out. It's like in two days. Actually, you know what? While I'm here. So how much more lumber am I going to need to upgrade the coop? I need 150 more. Okay, never mind. That's going to take a while. I'm actually, no, we're not going to upgrade the barn yet. I don't have enough animals to fill it. The chicken coop is the biggest priority, and then maybe the house, honestly. We are going to need to upgrade the house at some point if we want to get married, just because uh, we're going to need the big bed to do that. Alright, you know what? I'll think about it. For now, though, there are still stumps around, so I'm just going to gather as much free wood as possible. Also, I should probably restore some of my stamina at some point. I do have food on me. There we go. You know what? What time are you close again? Oh no, you're already closed, never mind. Oh wait, no, you're not closed yet. One minute. I... No, we're not gonna make it. I was gonna see if I can get my axe upgraded, but eh, it's already too late. We're not gonna get there by four, because it's already four. Oh well. We'll just start clearing away some of these rocks instead. Also, maybe an upgrade to the sickle wouldn't be a terrible idea either. Because, yeah, the weed regrowth rate in this game is just kind of absurd. Like, there is no way this grew nearly this quickly in the original game. Alright. Also, am I going to have to walk? Wait, do I have to do some watering myself? It seems like they've taken care... Nope, never mind. Yeah, I'm going to need to take care of some watering myself. I forgot. We have a few people who aren't working today. Never mind. Oh, I'm gonna need to take care of a lot of watering myself. Whoops. Oh well. Uh, we'll try to get this done before passing out, I guess. We might have to go to the bar for a quick drink before we keep working. You know what? I'm gonna go for a quick drink. Screw it. I did not realize I for Yeah, I completely forgot that I only have like two or three people working for me today. That's fine. We'll head home, continue watering, and then uh, probably head to bed after that. Never mind, bar's not open right now. Uh, I do have food. Have some good fried rice, why not? And a nice boiled egg. Wow, that did almost nothing. There we go. Alright, we have stamina again. Back to work. It's kind of hard to tell what has been wired and what hasn't. 
at this point, it, mm, I think these need to be watered. Not the pineapples. The pineapples definitely need to be watered, but I think these need to be watered. Yep. Just how few harvest sprites did I have working for me today? I mean, this is fine. Things are going to be a little bit uneven for the next few days, but eh, summer is almost over. What I do want to make sure I do, though, water pineapples. That's, like, super important that my pineapples get watered every day. The onions, honestly, could probably wait. Mm, actually, wait, how close are they to being fully grown? You know what? The onions could honestly wait a day. They don't need to be watered every day. It only delay their harvest for, like, one day, and I'm pretty sure we're good in terms of the timing there. I hope. I really hope I'm good with the timing there. You know what? I'm going to bed. You know what? No. We should probably still do as much as we can. It's only what? 11, almost 11 p.m. It's fine. We're gonna be dead when we wake up in the morning. Because the game does actually take into account how much you sleep uh, in terms of how much stamina you wake up with. Since we're going to bed so late, we are gonna be in bad shape in the morning. I am definitely gonna need to go soak in the hot spring in the morning. Oh, that didn't charge all the way for some reason. Also, I think my horse is stuck. Yeah, I'm pretty sure my horse is stuck. Also, happy Wednesday, everyone. We're almost done. Ah, oh, crap, I'm out of water. Yeah, my horse is trying to get to the stable, but the pathfinding in this game is terrible. Which isn't usually a problem, just because, uh... They can go through, like, weeds and stuff, but... That horse is having really big trouble getting in there. And I can't do anything about it, because you can't move animals manually in this game. Which is actually kind of weird. I kind of miss that. Well, I kind of miss that until I remember trying to steer my animals out of barns in the original game. And then I don't miss it anymore. Alright, 1.30. We're going to sleep for a whole four and a half hours. We're in better shape than I thought we would be. Honestly, I kind of expected us to have absolutely no stamina whatsoever. Forget how slow the story was. Alright. But yeah, tomorrow's the fireworks festival. That should be fun. Oh wait, I have mail. Ooh, pu ooh, pumpkin seeds. So since we sold at least 100 of every other type of crop, now pumpkin seeds are available for sale. Unfortunately, it's like seven days until the end of the season, so I can't plant them this year, but next year we can. Also, oh my god, I might have brought too many people to work today. This is fine. This is fine. Oh, also, I just remembered. Tomorrow is the... Tomorrow's a festival. We should probably fire Mint for the day. Actually, if I could find Mint, where is he? Oh, there he is. Although, from what I've seen in comments, people do say that... If you ship something on a har on a festival day, they'll just pick it up the next day after that. You know what? Let's test that out. Live. We'll see if we make money after tomorrow. Based on the stuff I ship tomorrow. Alright, but for now though, let's go take care of our animals. Yeah, I brought a lot of help in terms of watering and none of them can really do anything right now. This is fine. Also, I just realized I forgot to ship my eggs yesterday. Whoops. Also, yeah, we're going to be selling eights pretty soon.
There we go. We'll go take care of the rest of the animals and then probably head up to the mountains again. Oh, actually, do I even have fodder in storage anymore? I have none. Yep, I have no fodder. One minute. I can fix this. In fact, yeah, let me fix this real quick. I need to make more room for the uh, fodder to grow out. Level 5 hammer. That's not happening anytime soon. I can break this hammer, or this rock, right? Yep. Let's get rid of this rock real quick. There we go. But yeah, people have been saying that if I ship something on a festival day, they'll pick it up the day after, so... I'm just gonna give it a try later. Also, as for you, have your food. Uh, 11 days left to go. Okay, we're pretty much on track from what I was thinking then. I mean, obviously. There's no- unfortunately, there's no way to skip pregnancy in this game like there was in the very, very first Harvest Moon. Mostly because there's no animal medicine in this game. Because, yeah, I'm pretty sure that you just can't get sick animals. If you don't feed them, they just stop, like, producing stuff for you. Okay. Let's have to head up to the mountains, then. God, once fall gets here... We're definitely going to need a lot of help. In fact, you know what? How far am I away from upgrading my watering can? Quite a bit, actually. Also, I just realized I have never used my fishing rod. We're going to need to go fishing at some point just to get some experience on that thing. In fact, you know what? It's raining. There's nothing else to do. Let's go fishing. Oh, actually, no. Before we go fishing, there's one thing I forgot to do. There we go. Alright, let's go fishing. Uh, ocean fishing or river fishing? You know what? We'll go ocean fishing. Oh, actually, no. Before we go ocean fishing... Wait, no, never mind. I was gonna say we could go buy the new thing at the general store, but then I remembered it's pumpkin seeds. Yeah, we're not gonna go buy pumpkin seeds. I don't need pumpkin seeds right now. Wait. Oh, you know what? We kind of do need pumpkin seeds for next year. Do I want to go buy them now, though? You know what? No, I'll wait until next year to buy them. Theoretically, I could just put them in storage for like a year, but eh. It would be the smart thing to do, but I kind of want to save my money right now. Even though I have a lot of it. Actually, one minute. You know what? I want a coffee cow. I can afford it. Alright, so what am I naming you? So right now we've been going with the theme of like... Hmm. So the thing is, we've been going with the theme of like dairy-based products, but you produce coffee milk. I'm gonna name you... Hmm. Actually, will this fit? No, this is definitely not gonna fit. Cappuccino's way too long. Uh, how about a nice... You know what? I'm gonna name you Latte. So yeah, we have a coffee cow now. Just because. I do love the fact that there are different types of cows that produce different types of milk in this game. It's kind of really amusing to me. Also, I'm assuming it's like just milk or coffee flavored milk, not actual coffee. And I'm assuming it's not going to be piping hot when it comes out of there, just because... I don't want a cow that produces piping hot coffee. That would hurt so much. But yep, we have a new cow now. 
I wasn't expecting to actually buy one of the specialty cows until later in the game, but eh, we have pineapple money. In fact, you know what? Actually, no, never mind. I was going to say we could try to fill up our current barn, but we can't actually afford that right now. Also, I guess it's still not worth getting a barn upgrade yet. I still want to wait before getting a barn upgrade until I have, like, probably, like, six or seven animals. Because, yeah, it's going to take a while to, up to uh, fill up that barn at this point. Oh, crap. Right, forgot I'm exhausted. This is fine. We're going to need to grab some food soon. Actually, I do still have some uh, chocolate croissants with me. Or, sorry, raisin bread. It looks like a chocolate chip croissant, okay? I don't even think that's a thing in this game. In fact, you know what? Do I want to buy... Hmm. You know what? Screw it. I have the money. Think of this as an investment in the future, because the sooner we get these things, the uh, quicker, or the sooner they'll grow up and produce milk for us. Oh, it's already too late. Never mind. Okay. I was going to see if I can get myself a strawberry cow, but yeah, it's already too late. They're closed already. Never mind. In fact, you know what? We could get both a strawberry and a fruit cow. I'm pretty sure our next, like, pineapple harvest will cover that entire cost. Grapes? Alright, let's head home then. Actually, no, we still need to do a few things. I keep forgetting we need to go see the Harvest Goddess. I'm so used to going to her first thing in the morning that whenever I don't, it just completely throws me off for the rest of the day. Alright, we'll go see her real quick and probably give her, like, something nice. Like an apple. Actually, you know, it's probably a good thing we didn't buy another cow today. I might have to start saving my money to actually think of A, fall crops, and B, to start thinking about that uh, chicken coop upgrade. Because at this point, I'm really considering just buying the rest of the lumber instead of having to grind it out. It'd be quicker. But at the same time, yeah, I really should save my money. For... Actually, what am I saving my money for right now? Other than the chicken coop upgrade. I guess tool upgrades are kind of expensive in the long run. And then obviously the long-term goal is to maybe get that uh, town cottage by the end of the second year. I'm not even sure if that's possible, but I am going to try as hard as I can to get it. Oh, also, before I forget, let's actually go make sure we feed our new cow. Because the uh, animals don't come pre-fed. Here, I'm going to make sure you eat. Good cow. You'll be producing coffee for me soon. Strangely enough, there's no chocolate milk cow. You would think that would be, like, the most basic one, but no. They have a, they have a freaking fruit milk cow before they had a chocolate milk cow. I don't know, is chocolate milk just not a popular thing in Japan? Oh well. Anyways, I'm gonna go see the Harvest Goddess and then we'll head to bed. Whoops. Sure, we'll give her some grapes. Why not? Doesn't matter. Alright. Bedtime. I didn't sell my fish either. I probably should have done that. And we'll do it tomorrow. Also, hi, dog. Still a good penguin. No hurricanes, that's good. But yep, today is the fireworks festival. I love fireworks festivals in these games. 
Fireworks always, like, give me the feeling of summer. Anyways, I'm pretty sure it doesn't start till, like, oops, doesn't start till, like, around 6. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it doesn't start till around 6, so we have some time to kill. Also, yeah, you know what? I'm just gonna make a quick backup save. I don't want to lose too much money off this. Just in case it doesn't actually work the way that I think it does. But we'll see. If we get paid a ton of money the day after tomorrow, then yeah. Turns out the game does in fact just keep track of how much you ship the day before, uh, during a festival and just applies it the next day. Anyways, we're going to be spending most of the day harvesting today because I doubt Mint can take care of the entire field by himself. But man, we are getting close to the end of summer. It feels like just yesterday that summer was beginning. Seasons go by so quickly in this game. At least to me they do. That's kind of one thing I do like about this game compared to like some of the quote unquote later games. Time passes a lot quicker in the older games, it feels like. Anyways, I'm gonna let Min take care of the onions. I'm pretty sure he can take care of those himself. Uh, pineapple should be done by, I'm guessing, tomorrow the day after. I'm just gonna keep an eye on my funds at this point. I might go into fall with, like, around 10 to 20k. Because I'm going to be buying a lot of seeds next season. In fact, you know what? How many uh, green onion seeds do I have? Or green onion. Green pepper seeds do I have again? 18. Let me just do a quick bit of math. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So if I do 3 by... And then if I do 3 rows of that... I think I can fit them all in if I do that. If we grab like 18 of every type of seed. I'll do some more math once we're closer to the actual start of the season, but that's kind of the plan at this point. I'm thinking, yeah, just giant like rectangles of every type of crop. No gaps in between. We're gonna have a super dense field next season. The unfortunate thing about Latte is that I'm probably not going to have any baby coffee cows anytime soon. I'm going to mainly focus on my main type of cow, just because I got them first, so they're going to be here for a while. Here, you know what? Let's test this out. Hopefully we'll get paid for those tomorrow. But yeah, unfortunately, we probably won't be seeing any baby coffee cows anytime soon. At least not until we, like, upgrade our chicken, or our chicken coop, until we upgrade our barn. Speaking of chickens, I think after today, we might consider selling eight soon. Because I'm pretty sure nine's only a couple of days away from growing up. You know what? Yeah, I think after today we'll go sell eight. Fortunately, once nine grows up and starts laying eggs, we don't have to worry about this ever again. Because then every egg after this will definitely produce a maxed out chicken. Well, a chicken that has the possibility of being maxed out. Anyways, time to gather more wood. Because, yeah, unfortunately the festival doesn't start till 6, so we have a bunch of time to kill. In fact, you know what? I think I might just end the episode here and then just start the next episode already around 6. Just to cut out some of the waiting time, because we still have about 6 hours to go. So, yeah, next time on Let's Play Story of Seasons Friends of Mineral Town, we're going to go see some fireworks. Hopefully with Cliff. I'm pretty sure we'll be seeing it with Cliff. So, till then.